Lisa. Time for your feedback. Ah! Who's cuter now? The topic of hair loss is taboo, though less and less so, with male celebrities becoming increasingly open about their experiences. Or they haven't broadcast their struggle, rather, talk is generated by fans. Athletes in particular are constantly in the spotlight and under scrutiny. The status of their hair loss included. In part two of our series, we take a deep dive into these sports stars and what they've said and done about their balding, if anything. I am not bald, I am balding. Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor cemented himself as a household name when he became the biggest superstar in MMA history. However, not even he could fight off hair loss. While not too significant yet, the Irishman has a small bald patch in the crown area of his head, which could expand, and his hairline has significantly receded in recent years. Though not confirmed by him, many in the hair loss community believe that the Notorious has since rectified things by getting a hair transplant. You can be the judge. It's McGregor forever. And don't you forget it. Alex Caruso. When Chicago Bulls guard Alex Caruso was entering the NBA as a Los Angeles Laker, he had a full head of hair. However, with the years, he started experiencing severe balding. It's Caruso's. Yeah, it was Caruso. Given that he's still only 29 years old at the time of recording, it's fair to say that his genetics had a hand in this, and he's dealt with alopecia from a young age. Eventually, Caruso stopped fighting it, and thus began his bald mamba origin story. He decided to shave his head entirely. Oh my god, Meredith, what are you doing? Baking a cake, what does it look like I'm doing? Donna headband, and has become quite the spokesperson for men's grooming. A hair transplant is certainly out of the question at this point, but he would be a good candidate for a hair system should he decide he wants his hair back. It wasn't a wig, it was a hair system. Paulo Costa. The Brazilian former middleweight UFC title challenger is known for his power and physique. <laughs> Potentially due in part to steroids. What seems to lend credence to the rumors is the fact that Costa was balding in his crown area made particularly evident as his sweat accumulated there during fights, which may indicate that he was using hair fibers. As you may know, the use of steroids increases testosterone in the body. Increased testosterone leads to the creation of hair loss inducing hormone dihydrotestosterone. Whatever the case, Costa underwent a hair transplant in early 2022. And now that we've passed the one year mark, we can see it was pretty successful. Trey Young. Atlanta Hawks point guard Trey Young is a massive young talent in the NBA. Young led the Hawks to the Eastern Conference Finals in 2021, which kicked off a streak of him being a menace in the eyes of the Knicks. Young became the target of balding jokes from butthurt Knicks fans who were chanting, Trey is balding, while he was playing. Trey is balding! Trey is balding! As of now, Young hasn't done anything to fix this issue. However, he may benefit from hair fibers or a hair system. You can visit www.superhairpieces.com to jumpstart your own hair system journey. Kirk Cousins. Back in the day, Minnesota Vikings quarterback Kirk Cousins only realized he had a receding hairline once he went for a completely shaved look during a haircut. During a media scrum after the haircut, he spoke of how his father was also bald and that he was looking to avoid following in his footsteps. You like that? You like that? Today, Cousins has a much better hairline with denser hair. All signs seem to point towards a hair transplant by the Illinois native. It's a lot like, you know, life, an NFL career. You got ups and downs, you got highs and lows. Tom Brady. For many, Tom Brady is the GOAT of American football. He only recently announced his retirement and his level of play remained high throughout his career. You might say the same for his hair, which is remarkable given his age. That, however, wasn't always the case. Looks like that Tom Brady is starting to comb his hair forward and he has some recession in his temples. So those are kinds of signs that he's starting to lose his hair. Brady's hairline started to recede years ago while he was also experiencing some gradual thinning. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers quarterback was fortunately able to opt for a hair transplant before it became too noticeable. Andros Townsend. Andros Townsend was a victim of a major receding hairline that made him look significantly older than he was when he was playing for the Tottenham Hotspur during his 20s. However, the footballer shocked many when he returned to action in 2018 sporting a new hairline with thick, dense hair. Most believe this was the result of a hair transplant, and the results speak for themselves. Dak Prescott Dallas Cowboys quarterback Dak Prescott is yet another sporting star who had to deal with a receding hairline, starting with a typical widow's peak. It's not totally clear if Prescott did anything to fix this dilemma as he mostly wears a cap whenever he doesn't have a helmet on. 
Given his short hairstyle, however, Prescott could potentially benefit from the non-surgical hair loss solution of scalp micropigmentation. Rob Holding Arsenal defender Rob Holding is another Premier League pro who dealt with hair loss. Holding suffered from a receding hairline during his mid-twenties, which took a toll on his self-image. So he took matters into his own hands with a transplant. That's not for everyone. Francis Ngannou. Former UFC heavyweight champion Francis Ngannou was also affected by hair loss, showing that being the baddest and being the baldest obviously just go hand in hand at this point. In 2020, fans started to notice his hairline recede dramatically, while there was also bald patches on the top of his head. Eventually, the Predator opted for a hair transplant and was very open about it as he revealed in an Instagram post that he was not ready to go bald just yet. Don't think I changed my hairstyle. I'm just working on making it even better. I took the magic solution. If the magic solution isn't right for you, or even if you're looking for something to help in the meantime, consider one of our hair systems. They're natural looking, durable, and we all know these guys would have rocked them in and out of the octagon. Or court. Or you get the idea. Subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this, as well as tutorials, trends, and more.